her an opportunity to, to become a head coach and lead this team. And, you know, she'll do great, and I look forward to, to a good year this year as well. Ultimately, did you lose a financial battle to try to keep that? You know, I, I'm not going to you know hide behind the fact that the money in the college women's game is driven a lot by the men's game. And gender equity and Title IX has a lot to play with that, and that's a that's a big part of what's happening right now. And, and the salaries and the programs, and you know, and good for the women. You know, they're getting the opportunity to, to, to go after the, the dollars that are out there. And, no, we can't compete with that. You know, we're a business that um, has survived for 20 years and thrived, and we're going to continue to push forward. But if you want to be around the best women in the game, and uh, you know, be in a league that, that's really set a standard for professional team sports for women, this is it. And, you know, we'll continue to grow and we'll continue to, to move in terms of the financial piece, but I'm sure that, uh, you know, that women now are starting to realize those opportunities because of the